Hey everybody, it's uh, Brent back today for Humble Vape Tech. Uh, I wanted to show you guys a couple things today. Uh, Gunmetal Psy, which I kind of got a mix and matched here. And then uh, Vic sent me this out. These are going to go on the site in a couple days. And if they sell, they'll probably get more. We'll see how, how they do. I really, really love mine. I mean, I'm extremely happy with it. So badass. It's the uh, Tesla 150 watt touchscreen. I'll show you guys everything that comes in the box and how it works. It's just extremely easy to use. Like, I'd say two minutes into having this thing, I had it figured out. I mean, it's just so easy. I can love it. <laughs> Thank you, Vic. So, uh, kind of got this side thing that comes off of here. It's kind of cool. Uh, kind of held on with a magnet. A magnetic clip. Some of the info on the back is it's, uh, uh, 150 watt TC mod. Uh, it's got a screen protective film you can put over the top of it. I didn't put mine on very well. I need to try to get another one. It's got a uh, wiping cloth that comes with it, your USB cable, and your uh, manual. And then, like most other, you got your scratch off uh, you know, identification barcode there to make sure you got an authentic product. Pull this out for you guys. There's a little, yeah, see this little case here. So your manual comes in. in. There, and then you got your little Tesla 6 cloth. Um, I believe these are going to be going for uh, $79.99. Um, most sites, they go for about $94, so it's a little bit cheaper than you're going to see them in most places. I think you could go to sigabuy.com and get it for maybe like 10 bucks cheaper, but you're going to be waiting like three fucking months to get it. For me, that's not really an option. I'm too impatient. So that's what comes in there. I want to show you guys the uh, USB cable for this. It's fucking pretty cool. Yeah. And then here's what the inside of that box looks like. Let's show this. Fucking cool. It's like a different kind of material there. It's really cool though. It's really solid. I like this charger. I haven't actually tried plugging it in. Uh, you need to charge your batteries outside of this unit. This is this uh, USB is just for system updates, which there is an update that I want to go do. I haven't had a chance to do yet. You go to someone's house that actually has a desktop since <laughs> I just have tablets and iPhones. But, uh, I'm going to take you through the settings on this thing and uh, show you how it's firing for me. I mean, no complaints very happy with it um, I mean I think it just pairs so well with the hydro tube and then I mean there's so much weight to it you don't have to really worry about it falling over very easily and, uh, I think they just look awesome together it's just such a good it feels real solid in my hand but not too bulky so I want to take you guys through these settings I'm gonna click it on oh yeah before we get into that too, I want to show you, get it, you guys a better look at this gunmetal sigh. Take that off for you guys. So here's the top part of it. And as you can see, the inside of it is actually gunmetal too. Splash guard and all that. Um, the only part that is not gunmetal is the. Uh, um, I got him. The inside of your base on the very bottom. So down inside of there, you can see about right here on that lip is where it's kind of a um, the original color. But I don't see that being an issue for most people. Uh, one thing I noticed about this one is the cap comes on and off a little bit easier. Like, it's just a very small amount, some, uh, uh, smaller diameter, maybe, on uh, this part. I tried changing my O-rings just to see if it would change it. Um, it's not loose to where you're going to have any issues with it. I actually kind of like it. Uh, I've been using the regular on my hydro tube, so it's real tight, but then um, using this other base because it's a little tighter, you know, and then on this one, just I like using it because it's real easy to pull your cap on and off. So it is actually kind of a positive thing for uh, unless you're using a hydro tube, which it doesn't 
stop me from doing it. It's just a bit more stable with the original base. <clears throat> All right, let's turn this thing on for you guys. One, two, three, four, five. Fucking beautiful. <laughs> I love this thing, man. I've been having so much fun with it. All right, so you just go into that button right there. We'll take you into your menu. So. Uh, you got screen sleep, your brightness, uh, you can change your wallpaper here, and I believe you can load your own into it, too. Try to change these for you guys. It's hard to see. Sorry for the reflection, guys. Fishy, tornado. I like this one. So, and then you got your secondary menu, so you can lock your resistance, uh, lock it from vaping, so you can't accidentally hit the button. Set your material. Real easy. I got it on nickel. Uh, what else you got? Your memory, TCR, so you can go into custom. Speed mode is something I'm really digging on here. So uh, I have it on powerful mode. Basically, it makes your coil ramp up faster. So with these donut coils, they have a little bit of a delayed reaction. When you got it set on speed mode, it kind of gets rid of that. Or the power mode. What did I say? Yeah, powerful mode. Uh, I, I'm digging it, man. Uh, it really works well. So, uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, so if you want to change your wattage, you, uh, see where it says 23 watts right there? You just tap on that. Now you're in uh, wattage change mode. Tap on the middle there for 23 and just hit either one of these sides. So what, I just turned it to 22. I like going at 23. Uh, same thing if you want to uh, change your temperature. You just tap right on the temperature here. And now I'm into temperature. And then you just change it back and forth with those. Uh, I, I'm really digging it, man. I love it. Uh, I got a little bit of uh, Synex loaded in here. I got down the road yesterday. I wanted something new and tasty. Some real good fucking turpy stuff there. <clears throat> Go ahead and hit this thing with the gunmetal sigh on the uh, Tesla touchscreen 150 watt, which will be on the site, I believe, either later on today or uh, Monday morning. Uh, I highly recommend it, guys. I'm fucking really digging it. Cheers. Mm. <coughs> Man, I fucking love this thing. I mean, I'll always love my Pico, but this is for sure my main daily driver now. Uh, <laughs> I want to thank everybody for watching this video. I want to thank Vic especially for sending this out. Uh, I really appreciate it. This is one of the coolest things anybody sent me for a long time. I've been <laughs> playing with it all weekend, and I can't set it down. So, uh, you guys have a great day. I want to thank you all for watching one more time. Uh, go to Humboldt Vape Tech and check these out when they're available. And I believe the gunmetal size will be available in about a month as well. You guys all have a good Sunday. Peace.